Uh, I'm Guy Midgley. I'm from Stellenbosch University in South Africa. And uh, I served on chapter four, which uh, was a chapter that looked at scenarios of biodiversity. Um, biodiversity is declining at an unprecedented rate. Climate change is one of the drivers driving that change. Climate controls the ranges of species, and so a changing climate can cause species to change their geographic ranges, as we've seen in many parts of the world, on the land surface and in the ocean. And with respect to climate change, uh, we know what we have to do is, is, uh, is reduce our global emissions. Uh, at, at the same time, we have to increase the capacity of the Earth's surface to absorb carbon dioxide and give us a better chance to get emissions under control and to get the atmospheric CO2 concentration under control. That involves um, the good management of ecosystems. We know that ecosystems are currently absorbing about 25% of our emissions, uh, land systems. Another 25% of our emissions are going into the oceans, which is causing ocean acidification. Together, that's half our emissions uh, are not ending up in the atmosphere because of the, the health of our ecosystems. And so managing our ecosystems is going to be crucial in avoiding the worst effects of climate change. Uh, the most important thing we have to do is get our fossil fuel emissions under control and engage in the kind of transformative change that this report speaks about, which is transformative changes to our energy system mostly.